Hello, I'm Dr. Juan Corral. This is Dr. Paul Croner. We're currently gastroenterology fellows at Mayo Clinic in Florida, United States. The title of our study is Volumetric Laser Endomicroscopy, also known as BLE, in the biliary and pancreatic ducts, a feasibility study with histological correlation. Our study evaluated BLE in the biliary and pancreatic ducts. BLE is a technology that provides high-resolution, real-time, infrared-generated images of tissue microstructures using a probe inserted through the endoscope operative channel. Previous studies have shown that BLE can differentiate between neoplastic and non-neoplastic strictures based on the changes in the pancreatic duct layer structure. A new BLE catheter has recently been released using the same optical coherence principles but has improved characteristics such as 360 degree rotation, wider field of view, and faster image processing. So why did we do this study? Research shows that in the bowel ducts, the accuracy of BLE in detecting neoplastic lesions can be higher than biliary brushings, which is the standard of care. Furthermore, BLE has adequate inter-observer and intra-observer reproducibility. Preliminary data has compared BLE images with brushings and cholangioscopy. However, none of these studies have compared with pathology in a one-to-one -one fashion. Therefore, comparing with gold standard pathology ex vivo was needed. In terms of our results, we performed a prospective ex vivo feasibility study of histological correlation. We analyzed 25 patients, 20 of which were liver and 5 of which were pancreatic samples, and 111 images. VLE revealed three histological layers, the epithelium, connective tissue, and parenchyma. It identified a distinctive pattern for primary sclerosis and cholangitis, or PSC, pancreatic cysts, neuroendocrine tumor, and adenocarcinoma adjacent to the ampulla. Unfortunately, VLE failed to identify dysplasia in a dominant stricture and inflammatory infiltrates in PSC. Finally, Reflectivity measurements of the liver parenchyma diagnose liver cirrhosis with high sensitivity. So where do we go from here? We think that BLE can identify histological changes in the biliary and pancreatic ducts, allowing real-time diagnosis. We're convinced that BLE and these new catheters are a promising technology able to understand and diagnose hepatobiliary disorders. However, further stories are needed to measure the accuracy of BLE in a larger sample and able to validate our findings in vivo. We would like to thank the European Society of Gastrointestinal Endoscopy and the Editorial Board of Endoscopy Journal for this opportunity. Thank you.